This is 3D model of my robotic arm, which was project of my semester. And uh, I made that project overnight, so I couldn't get any pictures from that, just a few video videos. So just to documentize my instructable, I made this video. And uh, as you can see, I used these stepper motors. The model for these motors are 28 BYG-48. That was stepper motor that I used. It was geared stepper motor with 5 volt rating. And uh, here in this Tinkercad model, I just roughly made it out because there was no pre-made uh, stepper motor. So, anyways. And uh, beside of these three stepper motors, I used this servo motor. This servo motor was just used to uh, close this claw, which was made out of plastic bottle. And uh, here, I made it um, uh, using a freehand tool. And uh, <clears throat> there are two holes. I hope you can see. Uh, wait. Let me drag it down. And here. There. These. Uh, holes uh, were made so that I can put a um, thread to them or a wire and uh, I tied that uh, knot to this servo motor and when uh, I press uh, press the button uh, servo motor moved to few degrees and this claw was closed and vice versa for the open mechanism and the main thing was this base plate this was I really loved uh, this design, this design of base plate. Let me visualize it how I made it. Here, this was a uh, lid. There's a hole in it just to hold the stepper motor in place. And uh, if I move the stepper motor down, and this top lid or the base plate, this has an it has a hole here to hold this coupler here. This coupler was made out of ballpoint end cap and uh, it was here uh, yeah, it was stuck to this stepper motor shaft and uh, over this base plate as far as there was this um, this plate as you can see here these are um, two plates which I made this one plate and uh, same for the other plate they have a little bit gap between them and uh, and this let's move to the second motor yeah. this is the second motor and uh, it is using the same coupler which was uh, made out of ballpoint end cap and uh, it was also glued to this through a hole to this plastic plate blue color here and uh, at the end of this blue plate there was another stepper motor glued together and uh, this green uh, plate plastic plate also had a hole through which i glued this coupler which was mounted to the shaft of our motor and at the end of this green plate i glued this servo motor and with the servo motor i glued this plastic mm, this light blue which was a plastic from bottle glued it to the servo motor and that's how I made my robotic arm affordable cheap robotic arm it costed me around 3200 Pakistani rupees which I don't know how, what it will be in USD anyways this was my project and this was 3d design for it if you want to print it then obviously you will have to make modifications because I don't have a 3D printer and I have no intentions to print this model. I just made it to visualize my project. So I hope you will like this. Swadal, goodbye.